How did you manage to get to Tony D'Orazio? I had bugs and wiretaps all over the damn place. When that weirdo left the Royal Hotel to deal with one of his men, I was listening. I didn't know you was coming. I'm just packing away your latest shipment. How long have you been running this business, Joe? <laughs> I, I, I don't know, five, six years? Five years, three months, and 18 days. Well, this is turned. Look, I, I know I've been lied, but it ain't my fault. I've always placed a premium on maintaining order. If you let the rot set in, Eventually, it will take hold and destroy everything you've built. The only solution is to isolate it, eradicate it before it takes hold. You understand, Joe? Christ, Donnie, you gotta listen to me. Some nuts out there shooting hell out of everything. You know how many of my men he killed? Yes. Dominic, is it? You will take the armored car and personally oversee the collection of all outstanding monies owed to us. Am I clear on this? Y yes, Mr. Razio. Once you have collected what is due, deliver it directly to me at the hotel. The code to the elevator is 0451. From there, Lincoln had a couple of options. He could use the elevator code and go into the lobby, which meant shooting the hell out of the place. Or he could steal Dominic's car and go in quiet through the hotel's parking garage. When you're in the hotel, grab a couple of those little fancy soaps. <laughs> they won't give me any more at the motel. All units, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Huh? What's taking so long? I give it a month. Give what a month? What are you whispering for? For Tony of Dominic. That's fucked up, man. I give him six months, at least. Repeat, abandon search, return to patrol.
Fucking with me ain't smart, pal. You can die! It would be difficult not to. What? I've already taken the appropriate steps to address the situation. Believe me, things are well in hand. Well, they fucking better be. If this thing with the judge goes sideways, shit's gonna roll downhill real fucking quick. We haven't lost anything of any significance except for some men. And they can be replaced. In fact, they're the easiest thing to replace. Saul doesn't give two shits about any of those stupid things. All he cares about is the people that matter. Understand? I understand completely. And you have my word that all payments will continue as scheduled. None of our business associates need to concern themselves with our recent difficulties. Yeah? Okay. I'm counting on you here, Tony. Don't fuck this up. Goodbye. Take the rest of the day off. Okay, here's the thing, Congressman. When Mr. Durazio made his very generous contribution to your campaign... <laughs> Shit. Get around him! 
Vámonos. He's picking us off. You're covering my ass. Got it. Over here. This spade won't play. Got him over here. Kill one of our boys. He's down. Get him from the other side. Boys, Audacious, aren't you? Filthy fucking mongrel. You made quite the mess. Do you have any idea what you've caused? I think you know how all this is going to play out, don't you? <laughs> Idiot! <laughs> Go ahead. <coughs> Kill me. I'll be replaced tomorrow. <laughs> no one will even notice. Oh, oh, oh. You're wrong. Everyone will notice. You know what? Let's just get out of here. You're wrong. Everyone will notice. The streets of our fair city is a gunman stormed the Royal Hotel, killing an untold number of men. There was a loud crash, like a bomb going off. I looked up and there was a man falling from the top of the building. 
And all these men showed up, and every one of them had a gun. They ran into the Royal, and that's when the shooting started. <laughs> I still don't know how the hell Lincoln got out of that hotel. Where'd he scamper off to? God damn it! He's fucking gone! Available unit. Suspicious individual on foot. Officers investigating. Not much more I can say here, but I hope you do the stand-up thing and make it right between us. Calling me for only half the district was a real fucking smart move. Kept me on my toes. Of course, it'll be even smarter for you to keep me on your side. Need you to stay cool, Vito. I know you want this turf, but I gotta do what's right for all of us. And that means hearing from everyone. If Skelet is a guy we need, then you should take care of him here. We'll deal with anything else as it comes. As far as I'm concerned, Scaletta's a lost cause anyway. So make things right with me and your life will get a hell of a lot easier. You screw me over here and we're done. Vito wants the territory. He can get on his knees and beg for it. You have just one choice here, Lincoln. 
Don't fuck this up. Take us down here, Chucky. Square it up with me. Greco thought he had more brains than everyone else. Until they were splattered all over the floor of my chum shack. Ain't a territory in this city I can't control. Gotta say, this action's perfect for Cassandra. Don't matter your shade. You're just another two-faced scumbag like everybody else. And I'm through with it. Oh, fucking hell, Chalky. You're just driving for the trifecta of pissed-off nationalities. Huddle your shit with a cocksucking guinea, and then come back and square this shit with me. Good riddance to the Yankee-ass bitch. Vito's gonna know this is coming. Gotta be smart. Taking my time. intensifying their search for the colored male believed to be responsible for the massacre at the Royal Hotel. The suspect is described as six feet, three inches, and is believed They're to be saying armed. you threw Tony off the roof of the Royal? Actually, it was through his penthouse window. You always had a flair for the dramatic. Tony's ledger. Last couple pages are pretty interesting. Any idea what US 5CJ means? Wait a minute. Holy shit. Why is Lou willing to comp 10 grand a month at a brothel and the same at a drug den? Based on what Greco told me in Scaletta, Marcano's laying out a bunch of money to get gambling legalized. And if that's what you're after, who better to have in your pocket? Than a judge on the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals, US 5CJ. Exactly. There have to be over 20 judges on that bench. Could be any one of them. The kind of man we're talking about isn't used to people getting into his business. I start visiting the places listed in that ledger, He'll panic and go to Lou for help. And that's when we'll find out who he is. Keep that wiretap running. Never turn it off. How about sending some new wheels to Delray Hollow? Aye, I'll get her out to you right away. Just like you ordered. Appreciate it. 